Welcome to another episode of the Finger Tapping Frenzy We All Know and Love A WWE Supercard with him Big Jim and me Ninja Boy That's yeah. right people, Jeez. that's right indeed It's another edition of Finger Tapping Frenzy that We All Know and Love as WWE Supercard As he said, with me Big Jim and him Ninja Boy Sting of my thunder. You're the him Jim. I'm the him Jim. Now, mm-hmm. this is a special edition. This is something that we don't normally do, but we are going to be opening a pack. Now, why is Big Jim taking this extraordinary measure of splashing the cash? His hard-earned pennies, and believe me, they are just pennies uh, that I earn on a pack. WWE Supercard Greatness. The reason for this is, as anticipated, uh, there is a maintenance session going on for WWE Supercard on Thursday, December the 1st, ahead of wow. the Ring oh. Dummy Dim Dom event, which is featuring yeah. Shane O'Mac. Now, you may even be Shane watching this on Thursday by the time I finish some work I've got to do, and I've already got another video to edit ahead of this one, so we're a bit behind, but by the time you watch and this... And it has me in it. By the time you watch this, hopefully Ninja Boy will be in a new tier. Now, why could this have happened, and how is this going to happen? Well, if you want to call up your deck, mate, just show them your wild thing. Go into uh, wild mode. As you can see, anyone who did uh, see our video from uh, Wednesday, had to think which day we're on. Today's Wednesday, and we're filming a video for Thursday, and the video that's up before this one we filmed on Tuesday for Wednesday. You got that? Because we'll be asking you questions about it later. So, uh, the previous video to this one, probably the easiest thing to say, showed a ninja boy getting Roman. his pro Roman regains into action. And I was so close And it's to taken hard. him all the way up, just all the way up there to the edge of I've SummerSlam Plus Plus. Now, Cat Daddy have announced that because all these uh, deck problems that people have had trying to get their um, tier freebie <sighs> and indeed getting another pull once they've uh, achieved their new tier, some people have played two or 3,000 games and still had nothing, I played 1,000. Uh, basically, this uh, seemed like too good an opportunity to miss. We don't really want uh, Ninja Boy to miss out on the possibility of uh, a free hardened card. Yes. So, I've taken the very gracious, magnanimous decision to buy him an early Christmas present, and I'm going to buy him uh, a pack. Now, obviously, you can see he's got two WrestleMania Pros there. So he would. Well, WrestleMania Pro and Sam Slam Fusion. He would. Uh, uh, sorry, WrestleMania. Yeah. He would need to get um, uh, probably a SummerSlam Pro dropped in there straight away. Uh, maybe a bit extra, but Check certainly out. a SummerSlam Pro to get him into Harden Tier, which, as he says, he doesn't have. Whereas if I bought one of those blooming expensive packs, the uh, Elite to Ultimates, that would guarantee he would get a card that he could power up, drop in, and that would raise him up into Harden tier, so for this video, we should see him go into Harden, well one, we'll see him open a pack, two, we should get into Harden the, the tier, credits. and then get a freebie, uh, unless you're one of those people of course affected by this, but you should get a freebie in Harden tier, then we can come back again when we've had the uh, maintenance, and, get and show Harden you card. his Harden card uh, number three, probably. well no, it'll be number two. two, because you'll have an elite card already, at least. Maybe even an ultimate card from this pack opening. Now, okay. just as a little side issue before oh. we do this, for Big Jim, um, I've had a look at my own deck. Now, I was going to consider doing this for myself as well, which would take me into Elite tier. But having just seen the price of these things, <laughs> I think we're just going to have to stick to Ninja Boy's account. I don't know, I might change my mind on mine as we get closer to the deadline, I don't know. But I really, it's so expensive. As you can see, 5,000 credits. Um, I just don't think I can justify it on my account as well. Yes, buddy. Now I'm going to do a weird thing after this. I'm just going to put weird the thing. enhancement it, that whatever I get in the fusion chamber. Just see how many points it does, and right. then I'll just feed it into the card again. Okay. okay, you're going to do some checking on something, eh? Because mm-hmm. anyway, I want to know. Cut that. Let's give it some pack opening oh. action. Screen grab. Right. We get. Oh! <laughs> It's glorious! <laughs> As you can see... Glorious! Somebody's quite happy with that. So not only did he beat me to get the first epic card, even though I was in a high elite. tier. Elite card, indeed. <laughs> not an epic, an elite card. Glorious. He's now got an ultimate. <laughs> ultimate, ultimate, and a good one. Bobby Roode. So the, well, the thing here is, uh, buddy, is to uh, get him powered up yes. as much as you can. 
and get them dropped into that deck. That is amazing. Oh, yes. That is amazing. Yeah. Mm -mm. You have had mm -mm. some good luck. And I'm pleased for you. You deserve it. You deserve it. God, of course, you know what that does. That's now making me think, oh, I should open a pack. I might get an ultimate card. I so, never do. I only ever get like the lower rank of whatever you can get. It doesn't matter whether I'm playing Walking Dead and opening a chest or whatever whatever game I play. I always manage to 15, get... 15,000 points. I always manage to get the rank reward. That elite, an elite enhancement is yeah. 15,000 points. Right. You if can, of course, use that to help power up your... Um, Wait, power up your card if you want. It's very nice row of enhancements. We don't really care about those. Oh, okay. We want to see Mr. Glorious himself blossoming Victorious. into a fully powered young man. 29. Do you want to drop him in as he is and just see if that does it? What's he up to? Uh, 30. No, I meant what's his scores up to. His uh, stats are already phenomenal and you've uh, not even finished powering him up yet. I should have done... I'll get what a pull. You. What a pull. Wait. Yeah. You get me. 39. Goodbye. Was that a suka just bit the dust? Yeah, a suka just bit the dust. Being ruthless. Ruthless with his squad selections. Do do. Doing, doing, doing. Sorry, just bear with me. I was going to say that surely that must be enough by now. Well, it will. He, he is my best card. That must be enough. Let's drop him in. I did put him Let's in. Let's do and this. <laughs> and there we go. Boop, boop. Straight to Harden's. Well, no, hang on. Don't you want to save some of those for whatever your hardened pull is? Mm. No? Nah. He's just going full beans. He's gone full beans in a glorious Bobby Rude. Oh, yes. I don't wish to appear rude. you just got Bobby. Oh, yeah, right. Okay. Uh, can you uh, you now you stop keeping us uh, in yeah. waiting and play some matches and let's see what hardened pull you get. <laughs> He's happy with that. I'm pleased for you, buddy. Really pleased for you. I was just expecting a, an elite. And, right. Uh, well, tag team, they're gonna. Of win. course, if the um, if the pick selection thing works, you could actually get extra picks by watching the video as well, which would save mm -hmm. us a bit of time. But um, that's not working at the moment, is it? Mm -hmm. I've got a big mug of tea here. Mm -hmm. Lovely, you can't beat a lovely big mug of tea. It's a glorious win. <laughs> Ding. Sorry, what we got here? Two luck, right? At least you got your win. Should get your th uh, try to get three picks. Yeah. Three picks on my wagon. Nice. Right, come on then. Let's be hard and fast. Okay. Bada bing. Bada boom. Nope. 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 How far did I have to? I had to go virtually to the end of the deck, didn't I, to get mine? No. You can't remember. That seems to have been a thing. Some people seem to get it straight away. Don't forget, as I say, just in case, it might not give you... Don't forget, there are some people who've not yep. had a freebie tier, but you will get one um, after the maintenance break. Mm -hmm. So we'll keep going. We'll keep going. Just to see if it does happen uh, this time around. Obviously, it would be cool if it did, because then you'll get another card on uh, December the 1st, 24 hours. Wow. Can you believe it? <laughs> so you've got Ultimate Bobby Roode, you've got Elite oh, Nikki Bella. Yes. <sighs> Unreal. It's cracking oh, stuff. Yes. I tell you what, that does make it, uh, at least I feel a little more comfortable with spending all that hard cash uh, just on one pack for one card. Um, no. Because it is a goodie. It was so worth it. A goodie. Well, it's worth it in your eyes, obviously. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of worth it in my eyes. As I say, I'm pleased that it's uh, it's the highest rank you can get. That's the important thing. Because I don't get that luck. Things like that just don't happen for Big Jim. <laughs> it doesn't want me to use Bobby Roode in the solo match. Hmm. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I, it's really been a crazy good. day. Today is Wednesday the 30th of November when we're filming this. And I started the day with uh, knowing that I had a bit of football writing to do. For those of you who don't and know, I'm a sports journalist. The day wasn't Ill. And he wasn't very well, but he started to go to school. And uh, then I got a phone call offering me an interview with somebody, which had to be done today and has to be written up first thing tomorrow morning, as does the football column I've got to write. 
But I've also got the video that we did yesterday to edit for today. And then when we finish filming this, I'm going to have to edit this for tomorrow. So basically, I don't think I'm going to bed. I think by the time you actually watch this video, I'll probably still be up. Because uh, I'll have been waiting to see what happens with my own deck. Uh, I'll just run another one of my little 48 hour stints. Come on, you're going to give us a pull, amazing. aren't you? You're going to give us a pull. And, and Stone Cold and Roman are compatible as well, so they're like my new strong tag team. I see you're rocking your uh, Triple H card back still. Mm -hmm. Good choice. Come on. This deck, I'm not actually lost with this deck. Come on, yet. come on, come on, come on. I'm just getting ready. It did take me a little oh. while to get my pull, I've remembered now. Oh. It was right towards the end. Because I'd almost, f I hadn't forgotten about it. No, but this guy's got Ultimate Boy Ruru too. Has he? you. <laughs> I'm playing a guy who I don't know who he's got. I've got up to, Correct. I've just passed the 500 point mark on um, uh, Royal Rumble. Uh, again, for those of you who didn't see the video yesterday, we just actually uh, showed and proved the theory that your cards don't power up in Royal Rumble at the moment. Now, that is something that happened in Money in the Bank originally. They have rectified that, so matches in Money in the Bank do count on your wrestler, although they don't show up on your ladder rewards. Uh, but Royal Rumble, just to um, demonstrate, we stuck a Roman Reigns card, you can imagine which one, into the Royal Rumble deck, uh, played a match with it, and then when we checked afterwards, its stats hadn't changed. Uh, so I'd not been playing any Royal Rumble over the last few days because I had so many uh, pros I was putting together. I'd had um, a Carl Anderson Pro SummerSlam, a Kofi Kingston Pro SummerSlam, and an Alexa Bliss Pro SummerSlam. I'm working on an Italia uh, Pro SummerSlam, so... Um, playing in a mode where you don't get matches on your cards was no good to me. But as we've had this little break between uh, Roll to Glory and uh, another Ring Dummy Dim Dum, I've just started playing a few matches because I would like those Triple H card backs. Not Rybacks! Card backs! Right. I thought you'd finished. We're still going. It's the no, longest match like in the history. Match. It's the longest match in history. Come on. We wanna pull. We wanna pull. We wanna pull. It's gonna be a bit of an anticlimax if it doesn't happen after this, isn't it? Mm -hmm. What do you reckon? Is it gonna happen? It should. Is it gonna happen? Now? Tell no. you that. Now? No. Ugh. Nine more cards on the pool. Nine more cards. Oh, yeah. Another swig of teas in order. <sighs> I'm sure. We're not the only people who will have been facing this dilemma. Now, I've already had some messages both uh, on public Twitter and privately on Twitter from people saying, should I open this pack? What should I do? Do you think this will take my deck over uh, into a new tier? And of course my advice would be, as it is with most of these things, if you've got the money and you can afford it, and it's not going to cause you any hardship, then go for it. I mean, I bought that pack for Ninja Boy knowing I can't eat for two days. Joke, obviously. We just um, had fish and chips. But that's we've just had fish and chips. There it is. Let the cat out the bag and the fish out the basket. Um, we've obviously um, was going to be doing myself, as I said. But having looked at it, I think the sensible thing is not to. Way too much. I still may change my mind, but you know, I just don't think I can afford it. So I've set my budget and I've set the limit. I've said Ninja Boy will do it for you, Big Jim. Sorry, mate. Back of the queue. Can't do it. Uh, so again. If you feel that it's a bit borderline whether you can afford it, can you save that money from something else that you won't miss? And I don't mean something essential like medicine or food to feed the family. I'm talking more about... Uh, gaming? Yeah. Uh, another add-on to another game or something. FIFA packs? It's actually quite good if you set yourself... Oh, yeah, FIFA packs. We've got a story about that to tell you at some stage. Um, oh, Squad yes. building challenges, ripping us off as oh. well. Um, yeah, so... It's a question of whether you can rake that money back in from some other treat that you would normally give yourself, um, depending on whether you can afford to give yourself treats. If you can't afford to give yourself treats, then I would venture to suggest that you can't really afford to buy one of these packs. Um, and that's certainly why we don't tend to buy packs in this game. Plus, of course, these I'm sure this, the same with you guys. This isn't the only game we play. We play several other games, and they've all got this flipping um, opportunity to buy extra bits and pieces. Spend this money. Have you noticed? Spend your money and get uh, It used to be, really good packs whatever the game was, nothing. when they started bringing in these add-ons a few years back, you would say it was a, an adventure game and you'd got a knight as your character. You could buy 
an extra strong sword or some kind of spell that would help you out. Oh! Here we go! Nicole again! Oh man, that is amazing! Left arrow, right, she's compatible with Nikki! That is amazing! Yes. Ooh, yeah. That is amazing! And ooh, replicates ooh, your dad! Ooh, ooh, <laughs> yeah. Replicates Big Jim! Because uh, uh, uh. I've got actually got Liv as. Uh, that like, she's compatible with Nikki. That is so cool because we were discussing whether to buy him a female pack. And the female packs start at SummerSlam, and we we thought, well, it's no good him just getting a single SummerSlam card. He would need to get a guaranteed card, which is why we went for the epic male pack. But that's now giving you your second best diva. Female. Ah, oh, I did so well. I said females. I said female packs, and I got to the end of the sentence, and I used the D word. <laughs> right. So look at him. He's just he's sort of feeling frenzy. He's ninja boy. So he's now nicely geared up, as you can see, nicely geared up for Thursday, for when we come Pardon out. Plus. We come out of this. Look at that! It's amazing. When we come out of maintenance, mm. <laughs> Ninja Boy's going to be smoking cigars. Ninja Boy Lucky is going to be that. in hard places, and he's catching up with me. And I've been grinding all weekend. Um, me too. It's going to be uh, another hardened card for him. So yeah. it's coming hard and fast for the hardened oh, okay. cards. That is great, mate. That is great. I've got a lot of support. Well, look, that's it. We would love to stay and chat more, but I'm quite busy. I've got a lot of I things to do. I just maxed out the token time. Okay. Do you know what you're going to do? So three speed, three charisma, and... And then are you going lowest toughness. or best of the so rest? So it takes it over 9,000. Fair dues. Good shout. Look at that. Are you pleased? Yeah. You're happy? Very, he says. You're happy with your lot. High five? Yes. Boom! Boom! Room. Shakalaka! So there we have it! That's possibly our only pack opening video of season 3, and it's only one pack. But it's a damn good pack! It's a fine pack! And it's a pack that has seen Ninja Boy power his way in the hardened tier. Of course, we should see some new thank cards coming our well. way in the next thank you well. 24 hours. Oh, well, and it'd be rude of us not to film it. For you guys, let us know what you get uh, in the comments down below because I've got a feeling this video will go up uh, once everyone's already started pulling their new cards. Let me know what you've got. As usual, if you like the video, please like down below and subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. We're up to 19,200, heading for that 20,000 by the end of the year. 20k would just be blow our tiny little minds. And of course, we're on Twitter, we're on Facebook, we're on Instagram. Thank you ever so much for watching, and until we see you next time. You good people, you stay cool.